I did find a way to get the Adobe Photographer plan for free. So I'm not paying for Lightroom or Photoshop now. The way that I did this is completely legal and it's good for a whole year. I anticipate I'll be able to get another year free as well just because I contribute to stock photography sites. Adobe Stock specifically. And so one of the things I really like about Adobe is that they pay a lot more and I generally get quite a few sales through them. They're usually my number one or number two agency as far as sales go. Adobe Stock is one of the best stock photography platforms around. One of the reasons is they pay a much higher royalty rate than many of the others. They start at 33% for photos and illustrations and 35% for videos. This is much higher than sites like Shutterstock or iStock, which start about 10 or 15%. Once you sell a thousand images, they actually increase that. This is what we're here to talk about today though. If you sell 200 qualifying assets, you get included in the bonus program, which is the Creative Cloud Photography Plan, Illustrator, InDesign, Premiere Pro, or After Effects. And you get a full year of that for free just by selling that many images or videos. If you sell 6,200 qualifying assets, then you get access to the whole Creative Cloud suite. Something interesting is that a video counts as three regular downloads. So you don't even actually have to sell 200 full images or illustrations. If you're selling videos, then you can get there pretty quick. 2023 was my first full year on Adobe Stock and I didn't have any issue reaching this goal. Once you do reach that goal, you will get a special link in your portal. And this tells you how to redeem that special link. I'm going to get the Creative Cloud Photography plan with mine. And this is telling me how to do that. I'll include links to these documents if you're interested. So this is actually a really good incentive to get people to contribute to Adobe Stock. I started stock photography back in 2020. I joined a site called Wirestock and they actually do the keywording and describing of your photos for you. The downside of this is everything you contribute goes under the Wirestock profile. I did this until mid 2022 and then I started uploading my own assets to sites like Shutterstock and Adobe Stock. It took a little while to get it going. It's a lot of work to do this, to keyword and describe all these images. By 2023, I really started selling quite a few. I was able to get the Adobe bonus without any issues. That was actually one of the reasons I started uploading to the individual sites anyways. I knew that I could get this product that was valued at like $20 a month or something like that for free. And I was missing out on that with Wirestock. There were also some other issues. There's videos about that if you'd like to learn more. Uploading these assets individually really paid off. I'm making more money and I get this Adobe bonus where I'm going to have the Lightroom and Photoshop subscriptions for free. From what I gather, it seems like Adobe wants to keep this as a fairly easy to earn bonus. Here it is in February and if you count for video sales, I'm almost already to the bonus point for the year. So it's not that difficult to get. It does take a little while to build up your portfolio to the point where you'd be able to do that. So like when I started in 2022, I was in the middle of the year and I didn't have enough assets to build that up. But by 2023, it was no problem. And I had the full year also, so that helped out a ton. Currently, my Adobe profile is only around 2,200 total assets. So that's where all those sales came from. I love to save a good buck and stock photography not only gives me a little bit of extra income on the side, it's also now opening up some useful tools with the Adobe Photographer plan. It's nice to have something that's really high quality industry standard and not have to pay for it. That's a pretty nice bonus if you ask me. Anyways, what do you think about it? Have you earned your bonus? Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Till the next time.